Hey guys, welcome to another New Homes 101 video. Gilbert Patino here with Manny Patino behind the camera. Just wanted to mention, if you guys are looking to buy a home, build a home, or have any questions, please call us. Our number is gonna be on the video. So we're gonna look at this beautiful three car garage. It's a four bed, two and a half bath. It's a little bit over 2,400 square feet. Um, the exterior, they did an amazing job with the uh, wood. They added wood panels. Uh, so instead of the stucco, they, they stuck to adding the wood. Uh, let's check it out. So it's gonna have the pitch roof, uh, which looks amazing, especially with this style of home. You got the wood pillars. This is cedar wood, so it's gonna be a, a good quality wood as well. Uh, your, your plug, and then also you're gonna have uh, the uh, amazing windows here on the outside, which add plenty of light on the inside. One of my favorite features is, is, is the door. You have the uh, glass and it's not stained. It's gonna be the see-through glass, of course, which makes it look a little bit more high quality or a little bit more luxurious. Let's go on inside and check it out. So right off of the entryway, you have these built-in uh, shelves for any de decor or if you have vases, uh, which would look amazing. And this kitchen is amazing. Uh, so right off the bat, you could see this uh, dark uh, mocha colored granite piece uh, with this island. I mean, the island is huge. The big farm style sink, uh, it's a one piece sink, but it's huge. The black stained faucet as well, which matches all of the hardware around uh, the cabinets as well. A little bit of a darker, tint to the to the cabinets but it looks amazing well those are actually stained cabinets Gilbert and they're the shaker style which which makes the home look really modern I really like how the home contrasts you have your light colors mixed with your dark colors even the vented hood it's just a black custom uh, built vented hood yeah they did a, a really good job with matching colors everything uh, so a five burner cooktop with the hooded vent and, and it, it extracts to the outside as well you got your microwave and the oven. So this is nice, Manny. This is a butler's pantry. Uh, what's neat about it is that you have a cabinet here on this section and then you have space. And all of these are adjustable too. This is what's good about this builder. We did a video of it before already and uh, we talked about their mastery in, in carpentry. Yeah, you can see with the Vegas and then plenty of lighting here in the living room. And look at the view. I mean, you got amazing views. And what's nice is this, this is a basement home. So it's, it's gonna be like a very Midwest style home with the basement and you're gonna have the patio uh, from the basement as well. well let's, let's, let's go outside here. Actually, no, yeah, let's go look at the rooms and then we'll go outside. Perfect. I'm just too excited to go into that back. <laughs> yeah, it's exciting, especially when you have a very good view like that. So but, the so, garage is over here? Yeah, you have the garage, it's a three car garage. Uh, we can check that out in a minute. But I want to, I want you to check out the bathroom here. This is a half bath. Uh, so the guest bath, you might want to call it. So you got the f six centimeter quartz. This is the master bedroom. Again, you have very nice views from your bedroom. So you're, if you're waking up in the morning, you want your, you want to drink your coffee while you're looking at the views. It's amazing here. You can, it's big enough to add a couch. So. Here's the master or the uh, primary bathroom. Again, it's, it's very nice, six centimeter quartz, a double mirror with the, the vanity lights. You know what I like is that the, the primary bedroom and the bathroom on the second, or on the, on the first floor, if you want to call it, the main floor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they are. The, the primary room is on the main floor, which is nice. It's a little more convenient. And another neat thing is, since the builders are master carpenters, they decided to leave the closet blank so that the customer could design their own layout of the closet. It's very cool. Yeah. I don't know if you could see uh, right from where you are, but look at the detail on the windows there. They added that to every door in the home. Right, every door has it. You got your sliding glass door, leads to the balcony. You have your, your railing that matches the home with the cedar pillars. They did a, a good job with the layout. 
I can't wait to go down to the actual backyard. It's fully landscaped. You can see the grass. Oh yeah. And then I can't you have wait. you have the park behind you. I mean, basketball courts, pickleball courts, gazebos, slides, plenty of grass to play football, soccer, and then walkways everywhere. Yeah. Beautiful design. What's nice is you can sit here and watch your children play from, from up here. You don't have to be in the park itself. You can just be up here and, and watching them. Um, honestly, I'm excited to show them the basement. I mean, that the living room down there is, it's nice. So it's an extra Hard living room. Yep, so let's check out the garage before we head downstairs. I want to show show you the actual size of this garage. It's it's big. Again, it's hard not to like a home with a three car garage. You can always use one of the sites for your own personal workout gym or even storage. And it's nice because this has that extra room. So if you have a diesel truck, you have a big truck that doesn't fit in a normal garage, it'll definitely fit here. Now let's head over to the basement, Manny. Now, before we go downstairs, look at the, ch the chandelier here, Manny. The detail again in this home is amazing. Even the railing, it did a good job. Look at the amount of space you have down here. I mean, this living uh, living space is amazing. You got plenty of room for anything. You can fit a pool table. You can just have a different workout room down here if you wanted to. So you got a, your linen closet there or a small closet, and then the rest of the rooms are on this side. You got a good sized laundry room with cabinets and plenty of plenty of room for a good sized washer and dryer. Now on this side, you're gonna have the, the pump room, which we mentioned in one of the other videos. And then you have another storage room or you can use it for pretty much anything. It's a, it's a climate controlled room. So it already has epoxy in here. So it's, yeah. you don't have to deal with just normal concrete. They put epoxy, you can say boxes. Christmas stuff, I don't know. Oh yeah. And again, look at the windows. I, I think it just adds so much character to the to the home when you have detail just like that. Another bedroom here. Uh, they're, they're good size bedrooms. They come with the carpet. And you know, a lot of people uh, talk about carpet versus tile. And it's just gonna be a preference thing. I know carpet is, it's hard to beat. Manny, another bathroom here. So the thickness of the quartz in this bathroom is thicker than what you're gonna see in the kitchen island. Yeah, it definitely is. And, and the sink is, is huge. The, the space in that countertop is, is a lot. Got plenty of space. Two more bedrooms here as well. So the nice thing about these bedrooms is you have your own walk-in closet. So it's, it's a good feature to have, definitely. Again, another another bedroom with the walk-in closet and very roomy. Got plenty of space here. I love the colors. Light colored carpet, um, very bright walls, light colored tile, and then contrasting with the chocolate or mocha colored granite. Yeah, uh, I agree. They do a really good job with the colors, with the color schemes, with uh, pretty much anything. And I know you uh, you can't tell too well, uh, but you could see the, the molding there. It's a, a little bit over four inch. Yeah, it looks like a five inch. Check out this backyard. You got plenty of space here. Uh, they did a really good job with the landscaping. You got a few plants and trees, and then you have a non-accessible gate on this side. And then you, got, you have a little bit more room on the other side. Well, thank you guys for joining us for another New Homes 101 video. Manny and Gilbert, goodbye. <laughs>